Oh my days, Liverpool have just got to beat Man City 3 1. You're joking. Nah, dead shit though, yeah. Like, come on! Yes, lad. Lad, I can't believe it. Like, this is. This is actually like happening. Like I'm not saying that we're gonna like I'm not saying the sentence. I'm not saying you know what sentence I'm thinking of, don't you? Nah, I'm not saying that, but listen, yeah. Oh my days, what a performance, what a statement from the Reds, man. I can't believe I put me hood up because it's cold. But oh my days, the atmosphere was electrifying. I'm literally waiting for everyone to get out now. Um we're gonna start recording the Red Men TV fan cams and stuff in a minute. I can't, I can't, I'm speechless, like, I'm speechless. That's just one of them performances. That's just literally, like, I, you don't even know what to say. You're just happy, you're just made up that you've won 3-1. Like, I, oh, my goodness, just what a performance. It Just from start to finish, you start off with Fabinho's worldy of a goal, mate. Fucking, oh, my goodness, 25 yards out of absolute pure sexiness. Fucking, and then you move on to Mohamed Salah, who... A man who's on a mini drought, which everyone seems to realise when Mohamed Salah goes on a drought. And boom, it's just, it's, it's a victory. We're victorious and that's just what we need. We just need to keep being victorious. And then, my guy, my guy, man, like Sadio Mane, goes ahead and bags the third just to seal the game off. And then Bernardo Silva gets a little, a little cute consolation, you know what I'm saying? But, oh, what a performance. Top of the league. I don't even know how many points clear we are at the moment. I'm obviously not going to start saying, oh, we're going to win the league because, listen, I, I've, I've just been alive too long and I've, I've gone too long without seeing my team not winning the league. I've never seen my team win the league. I've never seen it. So it, you've just got to understand for me, that's just, it's kind of out of the realm, like the realms of possibility that that can happen, but it actually can the consistency Liverpool have shown throughout this season from start to finish through good performances and bad performances today was probably the best performance by the way um, but recently we've had a lot of very sloppy performances the draw against Man United even when we beat Tottenham when we beat Arsenal in the Cup I know that was with our kids but it, it, Genk 2-1 that was a very slow game today we came out firing all cylinders and I, I, I just couldn't I couldn't be happy with the results I'm going to try and speak to Paul um, and Chris uh, in a minute and see what their thoughts on the game was and because uh, I'm uh, I'm sorry if this video is just like a big sort of just mumble jumble sort of thing and you can't even you probably might not even be able to say it might be windy in the, the plane and stuff but just know I'm happy I'm a very happy man it's just I don't really know what else I can say do you get what I mean like, I went into the game very optimistic that we could do well, but I also, of, uh, rightly so, felt under threat by the fact that City have the greatest attack in the league. I mean, don't get me wrong, I love our attack, but they don't score as many goals as City, therefore they've got a better attack than we do. It's just, it's a fact. They play better offensively than we do. Now, I'm not saying player for player the better, but just as a, as a team, the way Pep Guardiola gets them playing, um, they can score a lot of goals. However, one thing City don't have, which we do, is defence. They can't defend. They can't not stop conceding goals because they're terrible at the back. Today was just another example of that. And... I just couldn't be more proud of my team, my club, my club, Liverpool FC. Hopefully, your 1920 Premier League champions. And, and remember, I said hopefully, I never said it will happen. Because uh, uh, as much as I like to think that I, I, I can predict the future and I can, you know, say that we're going to win the league and it'll happen, you know, uh, as great as it would be for me to stand here, you know, seven, eight months before the season ends and say we're going to win the league and then when it gets to that point, go viral because I was right again. You know, like, I want to do that, but I can't because I've just never seen my team do it. Um, and it's about time that I do see my team do so. Liverpool, please, 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 please. You will not get a better chance than what you've got this year. Trust me. I don't even think City... I got a notification. I don't even think City a second no more. I swear it's Chelsea. I could be wrong. Um, I haven't looked at the Premier League table. One thing I do know, and all I need to know, is that Liverpool are top of the Premier League. Ah! My days, right. I'm going on, Shay. You're all right. Uh, so yeah, that's um, that's pretty much all I've got to say on the video, and uh, yeah, like I said, I'm gonna try and speak to Paul and Chris in a sec. So yeah.
So we are, I was able to get the man, the myth, the legend, Paul Mason himself, you know what I mean? Oh, right, mate. Lad, that game was mental, was it, Paul? Unreal, mate. I, I, I think it's some of the best wins we've ever had at Anfield. Yeah. Think about us battling Arsenal in 13 14 yeah. and, 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 and Barcelona, and, and to yeah. be fair, that was. The, it wasn't even ragged. Yeah. It, we just we just dominated. It them. was like perfection, wasn't it? Like, who would you say your man of the match was? Genie Van Alden, maybe? Genie Van Alden. Do you know what? I thought he was really, really good, but I thought Chris had a shot with Henderson, though, you know. I thought he was brilliant as well. I, like, I thought everyone was just good in their own way. Yeah, like, the, the thing about Genie Van Alden for me is that, I mean, it's the same as Jordan Henderson. People, yeah. people have got a lot of criticism for, the, for players like that. I always hear, like, Genie was, you know, was, a, was a ghost yeah. today, etc., etc. He was he was dominated that midfield. And the same as Jordan Henderson, yeah. but I just think, obviously, we got it with Van Alden over the full course of the game. Yeah. You know, in the 89th minute, he's running channels still. Yeah. On me. Uh, like, Oh, it's just mad, isn't it? Like the fact we're like we're nine points clear of City, like, and then we're eight points clear of everyone else. Like City are four. Yes. City are four. Like, <laughs> like it's mad, isn't it? Like it's crazy. The four, four nice one, lad. No worries, also, man. as well, congratulations on a hundred thousand subscribers. Thank you very much, really, mate. Really, really you well next. done. I hope so. Get <laughs> you know that. Yes. <laughs> oh, so there he is, the man himself. He says it. Um, just a great day, man. I couldn't get Chris because he had to go early, but. There you go, there was Paul Machen. Let me try and not get it over. There we go. That's it, mate. That's the end of the, 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 the match reaction. I hope you enjoyed. If you want to see more match reactions like this, let me know in the comments down below. Thank you, everyone, for subscribing to James Redmond TV. I am back. I am here to record. And some good content is coming your way very, very soon. Go and follow me, Instagram, JamesRedmond96. Go and follow me, Twitter, which is the exact same thing. Leave a like, subscribe if you so wish, and I'll see you all later. Ta-da.